I say during my time with like TFC and stuff, I've probably been lucky enough where I've coached ten or so, maybe even more players that have gone on to sign contracts and definitely a lot more that have earned opportunities for trials. Um, the main things they all have in common, I think the first thing you always look at to see if a player's good, like are they next level good is do they know what's around them? Are they scanning? Are they checking? Do they know where the ball's going before it comes? You know, um, do they know what's around them, where to take their first touch? I think that's the, the hallmark of a good player and all those players have in common is their scanning and their awareness around them at all times was, was just top quality. And then the other thing you look at as well, again, which most of them had in common was if the ball goes there and my teammate receives it there, where's the best place for me to support or where can I help penetrate? And again, these players have really good understanding of when the ball moves, where to move, and that all comes from that scanning aspect, which is, I would say is the most important thing for all young players to know what's around them. Uh, apart from that, I mean, we've had a couple that got through who are just very tenacious, not just tenacious off the ball in, in their press, but tenacious on the ball, very, not very forward thinking players and I think the good thing is when especially at the younger ages like under 11s downwards it's they're not scared to make mistakes they go on trial or they come playing they're not scared to make those mistakes they go and show what they're about it's not about what they have got it's what again the potential that they could have and as long as they are scanning and they're looking and they know the potential is endless the tenaciousness is a, is a big one the, Again, like I say, off the ball and on the ball. Uh, apart from that, every player that I know have gone up there have been just really nice kids to coach, like pleasant to coach. Um, they ask questions, they ask good questions, but they're one of those that if you ask them to do something once and explain why you need to do it, you don't need to tell them again. They seem to get it and understand the forward facing movements that if you're working on that, um, yeah, they're just really, really good kids to coach and they understand the drills and they understand what they need to do to be successful in the drills. It just comes down to that understanding of the game, the elements around it.